Take the fool away. Did you not hear it, gentlemen? Take away the lake. Go to your drive, fool. I'll know more of you. Besides, you grow dishonest. Two faults, Madonna, that drink and the council will amend. Forget the drive, fool, drink. That is the fool not drive. Bam! The dishonest man mend himself. If he mend, he is no longer dishonest. Cannot? Let the tailor mend him. The lady may take away the fool, gentlemen. Therefore, I say again, take her away. Sir, I bade them take away you. Miss Prezion, in the highest degree, Lady Cuculus, non Vashi Monaco. I just want to say, we're not in my brain. Good, Madonna, give me leave to prove you the fool. Can you do it? Dexterously, good, Madonna. Make your proof. I must categorize you for a good Madonna. My mouse of virtue, answer me. Sir, for want of other idleness, I'll bide your proof. Good Madonna, why mournest thou? Good fool, for my brother's death. Hmm. I think his soul's in hell, Madonna. I know his soul is in heaven, fool. Ah, the more fool, Madonna, mourn for your brother's soul being in heaven. <laughs> Take away the fool, gentlemen. <laughs> <laughs> what think you of this fool, Malvolio? Doth he not men? Yes, and shall do, till the pangs of death shake him. Infirmity that decays the wise doth ever make the better fool. God send you a speedy infirmity, for the better increasing your folly. <laughs> Sir Toby will be sworn that I am no fox, but he will not pass his word for two pence a journal, fool. What say you to that, Malvolio? I marvel your ladyship takes delight in such a barren rascal. I saw him put down the other day with an ordinary fool that has no more brain than a stone. Look you now, he is already out of his guard. Unless you laugh and minister occasion to him, he is gagged. I protest, I take these wise men that crow so at these set kind of fools, no better than a fool's zanies. Oh, you are sick of self-love, Malvolio, and taste of the distempered appetite. To be guiltless, generous, and of free disposition is to take those things for bird bolts that you deem cannon bullets. There is no slander in an allowed fool, though he do nothing but rail, and no railing in a known discreet man, though he do nothing but reproof. Now, Mercury, and do thee with leasing, for thou speak as well of fools. Hmm. <laughs> Madam, there is at the gate a young gentleman much desired to speak with you. From the Count Orsino, is it? I don't know, Madam. He's a very young man and well attended. Who of my people holds him in delay? Sir Toby, Madam, your kingdom. Fetch him off! He speaks nothing but man and fire on him! Go you, Malvolio. If it be a suit from the Count, I am sick or not at home, what you will to dismiss it. Ah, gentlemen. Ah, uh, gentlemen.